On February 24, 2005, Haley turned 16. High school sucked for her. She was blind for almost her whole life, and this year it got worse. Every day someone makes fun of her, or they have to point out that she's blind, and she just doesn't know what to do anymore. Even though she can't see, it doesn't mean that she can't hear, and that she doesn't have feelings. But this was all before Lily came into the picture. Haley, come on, it's time to go to school, yelled Haley's mom. Ugh, okay, wait a second, I gotta try to find my walker. Haley and her mom got into the car and they drove off to school. Oh yeah, happy birthday, said Haley's mom as she walked up into the front doors. As soon as Haley got into school, she ran into the wall and fell over, and she started bleeding. Then a bunch of boys who were walking down the hallway yelled at her and were just making fun of her. Hey, are you alright? said a strange voice Haley's never heard before. Yeah, I'm fine, announced Haley. You don't look fine, you're bleeding. A lot, said the voice again. No, really, I'm fine. Um, who are you? <laughs> oh yeah, sorry. I'm Lily. I'm new to this school. I'm a foreign exchange student. I came from Great Britain, and I'm living here in California with the Bush and Whackers, said Lily. Oh, well, thanks, I guess. Here, let me give you a hand. When I... When Haley got up, she felt her walker in her backpack and it was broke. Well, this is a great way to serve my birthday. Ew, it's a blind girl. And look who she's got with her. She's got a little puppet master with her. <laughs> Said all the boys in the classroom. Shut up, kid. No one wants to hear your stupid little remarks. Said Lily. Hey, thanks for doing that. You didn't have to. I know, but you can't just let people take you down like that. It's never going to help you feel better. Just tell them to quit. Okay, I will. Thanks again. The next day, Haley walked into school, and she noticed that Lily wasn't there. She walked into her classroom, and she still wasn't there, so she came back out and looked around the halls. She couldn't find Lily anywhere that she went. Everybody just started calling her names again, but... She just told them to quit, and they seemed to stop a little. When Haley got to school the next day, she felt around to see if Lily was there yet, but she still wasn't. The following week came by, and she still wasn't there. And the bullies were still picking on her, and no one seemed to be nicer. Although she was used to it, Haley just gave up. On May 12, 2005, one of her teachers told Haley that Lily won't be attending this school anymore because she got sent back to Great Britain. Haley got to school the next day and everyone finally budged off and they were finally left her alone. Everything changed in her life after that. Lily basically changed her life. The teachers got more time to help her with the homework and everything turned out to be fine. Later on in the years, Haley got surgery so now she can see even better than she possibly could before. And everybody lived happily ever after.